up ladies and mushroom tips how you guys doing today i'm heading out to uh good old orange county hang out with uh suburban arson actually tomorrow we're gonna be um i'm gonna be going out with arson and his pops on a uh, sailboat doing some uh, fun little sail action sailboat action so i can't wait for that but tonight it's party night and uh it's currently over 100 degrees my bike's running 203 at almost 100 miles an hour and uh it's miserable like i can't even enjoy this ride because of how hot it is but my girl here she's been running pristine um i'm glad i did that coolant flush when i did because i'm sure days like this is where it's really shining she's got fresh coolant through her. i did all the checks I massively cleaned my chain and lubed it before I left. Did a little PSI check on the on the tires. We were set. I wish I had a fast a fast track. I mean, I could have one by simply having my plate covered, but you know what I mean. I I, I don't I don't have that. If I sound like I'm sucking off my microphone, it's because I am. I'm going like near night between 90 and 100 this whole way and my helmet's pretty much making me suck my microphone off. Yeah, it's pretty good. I just wish my microphone shaved a little bit. It's got a few too many pubes going in the lips. Oh shit. Holy shit, I just caught some gnarly air right there. That was fucking... My whole bike went in the air. <laughs> That shit's been there for years too, man. No one ever does anything about that spot. So I'm barely passing through Corona right now. I would otherwise be enjoying this. You know, this guy's got bikes all over his fucking back of his truck. Damn, so does that one. Hell nah. Hell nah. I ain't trying to get knocked down by a Huffy. Look at that. Hell nah. Dude, it is so hot that the heat coming off of my engine is hitting under my right thigh. And it's like, my my thigh is probably going to be hard-boiled by the time I get there. No, 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 don't slow. Please don't slow down. No, no. Is there one slow dickhead up here? Let me check. I've got a little curve right here. Mm, kinda. My dumb ass took off my bar and mirror to see if it fit my DR200 so I can get like that same one and I forgot to put it on so I have no mirror I have a backpack that's literally like like as wide as two of my bodies on top of each other dude this shit's rough my back literally feels like it's a full-blown like apartment complex swimming pool the only difference between where I came from and where I'm going is about a little over 10 degrees I think it was supposed to be 93 out here and where I in San Bernardino is 104. And there ain't no fun being in the weather like that, I'll tell you that much. That dude's got a butt snorkeler sticker on the back of his truck. That dude's full blown snorkeling butts. Dude, look at if I was in this, I could be going like 120 nonstop with no nothing in my way. If I knew it wouldn't fuck my bike up, I'd go over one of these little sticks here. Nice jacket, you talk, fucker! Dude, I love those Yamahas. That's a clean ass Yamaha. Damn, this shit's only going 60. I'm about to start a split. Now you speak in my language. Orange County line. All right, I'm in Orange County now. And then I avoid the tolls, so it gives me an extra fucking like 10 miles or some shit to my trip. But I don't have to worry about those stupid ass tolls. You know, like, no shit, my right leg is cooking so hard right now. Camper van rentals. That's kind of cool.
I'm just gonna use my 1000 cc powers to get me here faster. <laughs> Oh shit, I'm riding with my blinker on like a dumb shit. So is it a big old refreshment seeing the ZX-10 after uh, all the DR200 videos? I know, I know a lot of you are probably like happy as I was to see the DR200, but you know, I gotta show my big girl some love too. Also, it's the only bike I can do this kind of trip on, so. <laughs> Damn, I'm going faster than the fast track. Damn, someone's Cobra Mustang. Oh shit. No. Please no. I don't want to sit in traffic right now. I'm miserable. <laughs> low speed fucking oh 55 yes i'm by the 55 holy shit thank god i just need the 55 to the 5 to the bake parkway and we're all set baby damn my bike's 205 degrees like that's how hot it is right now Woo. and i'm starting to fucking dribble little sweat ropes across my like the upper echelon of my schnoz Hey, this feels like I'm time warping right now. If you get like stuck in the middle, which is not good to do, but if you get stuck, it looks like you're time warping when you're going through the cars. 55 South. Yes. Yes, I will. Yes, please, I will. I think that's what this traffic's for, actually. Everybody trying to go to the 55, the good old 55. Look at this. I'd be stuck in all this if I wasn't on this bike right now. You guys see why lane splitting is legal in California? It's because back in the day, air-cooled bikes used to be more of a, a thing. And when you have days like this that will damn near overheat your liquid-cooled modern-age bike, that goes to show the problem. So that's why uh, lane splitting is legal in California. And that's why the law is as old as it is. And I just heard that, so it's either true or not true, so... You be the judge. Nonetheless, I'm sure it helped out drastically in engines overheating and blowing. Damn, this shit's nasty as shit. Look at this guy with these little fucking, like, grandma fucking mobility scooter wheels on it. Holy shit. Just graduated class of 2020. Oh my god, class of 2020 boys. Oh shit. Now we just need the 5 south. Oh shit, I'm going 100. Don't even feel like it. Man, we've already had this bike for 5 years. Over 5 years now. And she's still been a beast of a bike. I think I'm just gonna go out and say, you know, Kawasaki's, at least, you know, the mid-2000s gens are really fucking reliable. And, uh, you know, I think it's my own testament to it for it to have proved itself to me like that. When in public, please wear a face covering. Okay. Yay, we got it. Man, those trucks smell like, like roasted coochies. Unwashed ones actually. Yeah, my booty is straight sticking out right now. Alright, so now I just need to get off on Big Parkway and we're there. A little bit there. But well, then I gotta get there, but. Whew. 
feels a little cooler out here. A solo motorcyclist, that only means that we have to catch up to him so we can ride together. Holy shit, it's way cooler out here. Like, and now it actually feels like pleasurable to ride. Holy hell. Man, the weather differences, that's why you guys see the beach is an arm and an asshole to live on and live in because, dude, the weather, like, Long Beach, I think it's only like 80 degrees where it's 104 in San Bernardino. And dude, 80 versus 104 is a night and day difference and a half. Like, it's fucking insane. Oh shit, he's on a hipster mobile. I mean, we are in Orange County and it makes sense. I'm shocked Suburban don't have one of those. A Triumph hipster mobile, look at that guy. Ooh, was that a scrambler? That's pretty fucking nice, I ain't gonna lie. I think nice. How is it a fucking heat wave day and it feels this good out here? What the hell, dude? I'm getting robbed in San Bernardino being in that desert armpit of an asshole. Well, there's Alton Parkway. I need bake though. That Triumph is fucking dope though. I fuck with it. We damn made it out here. I, I missed my damn exit like a dumb shit, but I think this is still the same thing. So we're out here on, um, I think we're by Long Beach. Oh look, you can see like a little fuck pad right here. Dude, that'd be so sick to beat Cheeks right there, like with the starry sky over you. We're hitting some swells out here, it's throwing me around. I might get thrown overboard if I don't take it to fuck easy. But uh, look how fucking beautiful this is. It's retardedly good. Look at these birds just like coasting. Look at these guys. Look at this shit. Look at that motherfucker. He's like literally just like looking for some good old fishies. I would love to fish right now. I wish we had some poles. Got some helicock suckers down there looking at everything. So over here is the uh, Queef Mary. And we just passed the Iowa battleship. I wish I had this thing running. I forgot that I brought this, honestly. I'm glad I found it now and remembered, but thought I could take you guys out for a little inside peek of uh, the sailing. Oh my god, this is scary. I don't even know if I'm a chance this thing's been getting thrown around so much. Nope, nope, I'm going back. I'm going back. Oh shit. I'm, I'm about to fucking, I'm about to eat literal dick right now. Like, I'm gonna have a whole dick just fucking falling right here and just eating it. I don't think there's anything that I could say is more fun than this. I love boating so much. Even though I'm, I'm literally terrified of the ocean. Like, if I fell in that ocean, I'd probably like cry of terrifiedness but this is chill oh we got benny the shark that might be the most uh, adorable shark i've ever seen look at my little jbl clip i want to do a titanic right there on the top i have to do it at least once damn damn boy damn boy he's thick boy that's a thick ass boy
have now approached a seal beach, I think it is. I bet that's windier than shit right now, but it's almost like sickening how huge some of these houses are. And they're literally right on the ocean. <laughs> There's a little shark on board. Shark on board. Show you the boat real quick. Got a little cabin here so you can like beat off while being able to look outside and see the beautiful ocean. This is if you want to beat cheeks in the rear of the boat. You know, currently under construction of the uh, cheek beatage cottage, but uh, it's a nice little room. Fuck, you get sprawl out huge right here. Sleep comfortable as fuck. Or actually, I think the engine's here, but nonetheless. in here so you can fucking beat your cheeks on the toilet seat go ahead and fucking eat some food whatever the hell you may have got a little sink to make some food and while you're cooking on the stove you got a window right here so you can have a nice little outlook of the uh, ocean no smoking <laughs> and then we got this cool Victorian staircase quarter spiral and then we got a cool little area here. We got a little table, a little desk so you can set up your Twitch setup and uh, do some Twitch streams here. And then you're probably thinking like, oh, that's that's pretty pretty big boat. We ain't done. Then we got a whole other cheek beatage cottage here. And you got a toilet to take a shit. And then what do you think? Another room. Go ahead and sprawl out, sleep, put your shit up there. A full blown bedroom, tons of storage. And I think there's like another uh, door to the bathroom right there. This boat's fire as shit. I like it.